Seth Meyers from Proxy Empire. So you said that you know between 160 and 175, no one can knock you down. And Mike consistently, he, he spot at 175. How do you strategize against taking on a quote unquote bigger guy? Um, well, I said that is he going to rough me up like Jose did because I don't think he's as good as Jose at doing that, so he can't. Or is he going to outbox me? And I'm saying there's no one from 160 to 175 who can stand there in front of me and try to outbox me. So, but as far as him coming down, being the bigger guy, if he's going to try and come and rough me up, good luck. If he thinks he's going to stand in front of me and try to outbox me, best of luck. If you like it, I love it. And has, does he remind you of anyone you've boxed before? Um, I treat, it's just another guy to me. It's just another guy. I don't, I'm not, oh, this guy and oh, that guy. I'm not treating Jose like he was this big guy, but then looking at Mike down here, I put them all on the same pedestal because each one of those guys has an equal chance of knocking me off my throne and sending me back to where I'm from, and I'm not going to allow that to happen. Is there anyone on your mind other than Mike that you want after this fight? Just Mike Lee. That's it. I'm not focused. As I said before, you start counting your chickens before they hatch, and they may not hatch at all. So right now, my eyes are fully set on July 20th, defending my world title, and then we'll go on to the next phase after that. Hey, we wish you the best of luck. Thank you, sir. I appreciate oh, that. Thank you.